Hey guys, it's Victoria and welcome to today's video. So this one is going to be another haul, which I wasn't expecting to do one so soon, but I ended up needing a few things and then I got distracted and bought a few more things. You know how it goes. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much what this video is about. So I went to a few different places, um, Bath and Body Works, Sephora, and Target, and I just wanted to show you guys what I got. And yeah, also, I am going to be changing my upload schedule. I'm going to be uploading on Sundays from now on um, because I do work overnights on the weekends and I can spend my time editing then and so it makes it a lot easier for me to be able to get my stuff done because um, I've been missing my Wednesday uploads quite a bit recently and um, I don't want to keep missing them so since I'm pretty busy during the week I decided that I will be uploading on Sundays now so that I can get my videos out for you guys. Um, on the right date so it'll be Sundays at 12 p.m. Um, Central Time but yeah I hope that's okay with you guys um, it's what works best with me and I want to be able to give you um, the content that you deserve so we're just gonna get started um, so the first place that I went was Bath and Body Works so that's where I actually needed to go because um, there's a few things that I wanted to get so yeah so I got two little bags from Bath and Body Works Bath and Body Works always has deals as you know um so they had four soaps for like 20 or something like that i'm not for sure um so i just grabbed four and i only do the foaming soap um the foaming soap is the superior soap um so i got b positive which is like strawberry lemon literally just smells like strawberry lemonade uh, mahogany teakwood which is a go-to it's a super common then I got pumpkin cupcake because they did have some of their fall stuff out and this one just smells really good and then endless weekend which is another one of my go-to's it's one of their signature scents um, but it just smells so good it just smells like summer so for the time being since it is July still I'm going to probably just have these two um, probably this one at the sink and this one or this one in the kitchen this one in the bathroom and so for whatever reason my car smells really weird right now so I decided to grab one of the car air freshener things um, so I just got mahogany teakwood for the scent which is really strong so I'm a little bit nervous it'll give me a headache in my car um, but I'm not for sure I guess we'll just find out that was just one that I knew that I liked so I went ahead and got that one um, and then I just got a plain black that clip for it to go in just that matches my car and then I also picked up a um, stress relief eucalyptus spearmint hand sanitizer to throw in my car or my bag or something so I always have some with me and then I picked up a candle because they're 50% off and this one is Ocean Driftwood. Looks so pretty. It's got some like seashells on it and everything. Kind of smells like mahogany teakwood does. Um, just like a musky, like men's deodorant scent. That's how Skylar described it. But I think it's pretty good. Um, so I grabbed that. And then what I really went there for... Um, I saw these TikToks using the, like, Airwick, um, diffusers in the Bath and Body Works wallflowers, like, plugins. So I wanted to try it. I haven't picked up the Airwick diffuser yet, but I got wallflowers. They're 5 for 24 I think. And they're originally, like, $7. Yeah, seven fifty on their own. So I was like, you know what? I'm doing it. I'm getting 5 Um, so... Just grabbed five of them. I got another stress relief eucalyptus spearmint, but I probably won't be using this one because um, I found out that it gives Skylar a headache, like this kind of spearmint scent does. So I'll probably be giving this to like my mom or like one of my friends or something. And then I got honey wildflower, which is one of their summer scents, and I didn't know that I was gonna like it this much. Um, it was like one that I hadn't smelled before, but I smelled it and it was really good. Then I got leaves for the fall time because this is one of my favorites. And champagne toast, another go-to. And once again, another mahogany teakwood. So then while we were at the mall, we stopped in at Sephora just um, to look around. And I ended up grabbing a um, Anastasia Brow Wiz because I just needed something for my brows. I got rid of my old brow products. So I got the color taupe because that's what I'm thought that I was because I have their like the gel brush thing um and that's and that's the color that I had that in so I just picked this up so I can do my brows with it 
And then while we were there, um, I was with one of my friends who wanted to stop in at the like perfume and cologne section. And I was like, well, the only perfume that like I've ever really had was the Taylor Swift Enchanted one, um, which I love. But that's, I don't really like perfumes because I feel like they all have like an alcoholic scent. So I never really like buy any new ones. Um, but I got like kind of ambushed by a worker, but he ended up helping me and I did grab a perfume. And it is the Marc Jacobs um, Oh So Sweet. I apologize for the noises. My cats are very playful. Um, but yeah, it's just a floral, like, sweet scent. And why did that spray my leg? And I just think it smells really good. Um, and it's not too, like, alcohol scented. Um, but, like, Marc Jacobs has scents for everyone, so... Yeah, and the packaging is just really cute, so this is all that I got from Sephora. And lastly, I went to Target, and Target is having, like, they have the dorm um, section up now, and obviously I'm not going to be living in a dorm, but they have, like, college dorm type stuff made for, like, smaller rooms, so it's like I have a very small apartment, and everything's really cheap. So, I grabbed two pillows, they were each $5, but these were each five dollars and I've really been digging like orange and sage green so I got this one which is striped and it's just really cute and then this one which is kind of like a velvety texture and it is just sage green I thought that would look really cute on my couch you know for summertime and then I also just picked up two of these um plates just because we really like these plates we use them all the time they're 50 cents each they're really nice and um they fit really well in my little dishwasher because you can they're so thin you can put a lot of them in there they don't take up a lot of space which is really nice and then i grabbed this um car mount i got it because the one that i have in my car is for like the pop sockets and i haven't used a pop socket in a while so i can't use it but i really like having this type of thing because um it makes it really nice for like when I'm using maps to get somewhere or something. Um, just makes my life a whole lot easier. Or like if my like somebody like calls me or something, I can like easily just answer it. I'm trying to get it out. Okay, so this is like what it looks like. It's like I think it expands. You press these, and it like that's cool. And then it comes with a little vent clip that you just put on there so it works for either type of vent like this way or this way but yeah there she is sorry that took so long because I'm stupid and then my wash band is really gross because it's white and I've had it for like two years and I dyed Skylar's hair black while wearing it so I got it all over it um, so it's like yellow now so I just got this black wash band, except I got it for a 42 slash 44, um, and my watch is a 38, I didn't look. So I'm gonna have to return it and get a new one. And then the very last thing that I got at Target is this Polaroid camera, and yes, I do already have a Polaroid, but it's the Insects Mini, and I just wanted a different one for the different, um, like film and I do really like this one um so I accidentally got the wrong one I thought I was getting a different one but I ended up getting this one and I actually like it a lot though so I'm not even mad um but it gives like a super like filmy look to pictures I really like the like film look it gives it is the Polaroid Go um and it has its own film. It's like the Polaroid Go film. It's super small. Oh my gosh, it has a timer. Um, but it came with like some stickers and the film packs each come with like these little sticky things to put on like the back of your film so you can like hang it on the wall or something. But this is what the camera itself looks like and it's really cute and small. I've got some stickers on the back, but I love how it looks. Um, unfortunately, all the packs only come with eight, but like, I like that you can turn the flash on and off. And so you take a picture and it comes out like this, and then you just push this back, pull it out, and you're supposed to put it 
like face down so it can develop and it takes it takes a bit longer to develop than um, the Instax does. So the viewfinder thing is a freaking mirror so when you're taking pictures you can see but yeah now that I have made a giant mess on my floor um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below because I am now posting videos every Sunday and um, yeah I'm really excited to hopefully get back on track and um, yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!